You need to watch this if you love diving or flying. Decompression sickness can hit fast. And knowing the signs could save your life. Let's break it down. You know how when you open a soda can too fast it fizzes everywhere? Well, that's kind of what happens in your body with decompression sickness, but way worse. Decompression sickness happens when pressure around you drops too quickly. Think when divers or high-altitude pilots ascend too quickly, the nitrogen that's dissolved in their blood starts forming bubbles. Ouch! It's like their body becomes a human soda can. These bubbles can block blood flow, wreck tissues, and trigger pain or even nerve damage. Mild cases? Joint pain? Rashes and itchy skin? The classic bends? Severe cases? Numbness? Confusion? Chest pain? Or trouble breathing? Now here's the cool part. Doctors diagnose this by looking at your recent diving or flying history and how you respond to oxygen treatment. It's like giving your body a reset button. They pump you full of 100% oxygen and sometimes put you in a hyperbaric chamber. It's like a time machine that sends your body back to when it was under pressure. This forces those pesky nitrogen bubbles to shrink and dissolve, restoring normal flow. Prevention is key. Ascend slowly, stay hydrated, and always follow decompression schedules. Decompression sickness is dangerous, but remember folks, in diving in high altitudes, slow and steady wins the race. This has been One Minute PhD. Like and subscribe for more interesting facts.